Hey Goobers, welcome back to Astroneer. Um, where was I heading to? Oh yes, I remember what I was going to do now. I was gonna go to that one planet, Glacio, one of my favorite planets, so I can get Hematite and Titan. Titanite? Yeah, Titanite at the same time, because I need both of those to get items. If I get those, then I can make things like the chemistry lab and stuff. Well, actually, wait, I already have a chemistry lab, but the atmospheric condenser so that I can make more interesting things. So now that I have those, I need a medium printer? Yeah, a medium printer. I can make a medium printer. Yes, 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 yes. Should I take my ball with me? Will I have enough room to take the ball with me? No, I don't have enough room to take the ball with me because it takes a 4x4 grid. I just remembered that. No ball. No ball. Sad days, sad days. How much resin is it to make a large platform? Okay, it takes three resin to make a large platform B, but I also could just make a medium platform. So let me get two resin for now. You know, I'm currently listening to like some of my favorite music right now. I'm wondering what, like, what is your guys' favorite music? Because I know right now I'm currently on like a... What's her name? What's that? What's the artist's name? Leve? Yeah, Le... I can't remember if it's pronounced Leve. Okay, it's spelled Leife. La Laufe? But it's pronounced like Leve or something? I don't really know. I just, I've heard that and I'm just still very confused about it. But I like her music. I don't know if I consider it jazz. I don't, I don't even know what the hell you'd call it. It's, it's just... It's just cool. I just like her music. I freaking love the, um, what's the, I don't know what the, the little, little thing he's called. The little pink square. It makes it so the sky can become really pretty, and I really appreciate it. I love just how, pr oh my goodness. This game's really pretty. It's so simplistic and pretty at the same time, and I love it. Also, I apologize for my base being just absolute mess. I need to clean this base up. Like, actually, it is, it's a mess. I am so sorry. This tractor, it's just sprawled out. I don't... Ah, uh, I gotta do something about this at some point. <laughs> okay, so, I have the three medium resource canisters so I can collect the hematite and the titanite. I have these windmills so I can get power. I have this platform so I can place down the medium printer so that I can make the large platform so that I can also make the large printer so that I can make the landing pad and... Okay, I think that's it. Yeah, I don't think I need anything else. Wait. I might need one other thing. Nope, I already have an oxygenator, so yeah, I'm actually good. Is there anything else I want to bring there? I've been seeing, like, other videos where it's, like, 100 days in Astroneer. And I've been seeing those videos, and I'm like, how do you tell how many days have passed in the game? I've been trying to figure that out, but I don't see where I'd look look for it. Like, I am I have no clue how to tell how many days I've played. I don't think I've played that many days yet. But eventually, I am going to get into, like, the higher numbers of days. And I'd like to know how to see how many days I've been playing whenever I do actually get into a high amount of days. I Wait, did I just, like, completely mess up an entire tether line? Yes, I did. Because I'd hate to actually just have to freaking, like, guesstimate, like, how long I've been playing on the world. Because I can guesstimate. I can look up, like how long a day is an astroneer and then divide it by how many like hours have been played on the world which i can do but that's cringe i want to just have like a funny number that's on the screen that just tells me you have played this many days like just tell me that why is that not a thing especially since they've released a hardcore mode i really feel like they should have a way to count the days Besides dying, because they do show you how many days you played when you die, but that defeats the whole purpose of a hardcore. You're not supposed to die. Oh, I just hit my mic. I apologize. But you're not supposed to die. That that defeats the purpose. It just it frustrates me. It frustrates me. I want to know how many days I've played. I know I haven't played many days yet, but eventually I will play. I will have played a lot of days, and I would like to know how many of them I've played. There we go. I can speak English. I swear. I swear I speak it. I this is I know it's crazy to think that this is my first and only language is English and yet I I struggle with it this much. 
I think at some point I may move my proper base to Glacio because I'm not gonna like Glacio is my favorite planet. I don't know why Glacio is my favorite planet. I just I love Glacio. It's it's such a fun planet for me. It's probably because I can get Hematite and Titanite on it really easily. You can get Hematite really easy on, on Glacio, and Hematite is my favorite material by far. I love Hematite. It has the most satisfying sound out of any single thing in Astroneer. What? What? Huh? What am I run- Oh, there's a little tiny speck. Let me get that real quick. Got it. There we go. Okay. That was gonna bug me to no end if I did not find that. I'm out to get resin. I'm not out to get this. I'm gonna get, I'm gonna get the snowman. I don't care that I'm out here to get resin. I want the snowman. Give me your loot. Now. I need to make tethers now. <laughs> Why'd you wait? I think there were some tethers over here if my memory does serve me correctly. Yes, it does. I see the tethers. Give me the tether. Yum. I think there was also some compound over here if my memory is correct. Maybe. I need to not do that on Glacio, because Glacio's plants are even more dangerous than this planet's plants. I need to be careful on Glacio. Oh my god. <laughs> now I think I have everything I could possibly need. Probably, because I can make a lot of different things for the planet now. So yeah, let's head to Glacio. Launch to another planet, yep. Okay. Which one is Glacio? I'm assuming it's a blue one. That's Silva. That's Aatrox. That's Kalidor. Where's Glacio? Is that Glacio? No, that's Novice. That's Visania. There's Glacio! That's where I'm trying to go. Okie dokie. Now, which one of these looks like a suitable landing space? That one's really close to the triangle, so I'm gonna land there. Seems like a good place to me. Oh, look, it's one of those things right here. Oh, wow, that's actually really cool. Hematite is right there. I'm so happy. Oh, I'm so... That's dangerous, plants. Let's take care of these plants real quick and hopefully not die. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. I'm gonna be honest, I completely forgot those exploded. That is terrifying. Oh my god. I thought they just, like... They did a little, haha, funny you got hit. But no, they just fucking explode? Are you serious? Also, ooh, research items. This debris is in the way and I can't see what's in here. Ooh, that's a windmill, I'll take that. There's some ammonium, a solid fuel jetpack. Is there anything else in there? Argon! Oh yeah, that's the native, uh gas that's on this well i think there's other gases but argon's like the main gas that's on this planet that's pretty cool 153 bytes is wild okay well uh i may be coming back because my friends want to play warlords and i'm gonna be honest i kind of want to play warlords with them i could probably come back to this and remember what i was doing right if, if if worse comes to worse i can just come back and look at the footage it's fine let's enter the rocket ship and I will see you guys, I don't know when. <laughs> okay, what was I doing when I came back here? Okay, so I kind of remember what I was doing. I think I was like making things. And um, yeah, I did not immediately come back to the game. I wanted to immediately come back to the game, but when we finished doing the, uh, the dungeon in Destiny, it was like 2 a.m. and I was a wee bit tired. <laughs> you know, I see that over there. I just saw it, yeah, that, that is ammonium. There's ammonium right here. These usually have like really, really big research items that you can collect. So hold on, I'm gonna get a piece of ammonium and I'm gonna open that because I am super curious. Now, we attack the purple plants. 
the demonic purple plants, I destroy them because I don't trust myself around them. Perfect. Ooh, and that's a little bit of a yoink. Ooh, I see another little space station over there. That means we can get some more cool loot. Let me open this. Pop this right here. What's it gonna give us? Oh, it's a big one. That's what I'm talking about. Oh man, I have so many research items here now. I might actually just set up a re uh. What is it called? Research chamber? Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna set up a research chamber before I leave so that all of this can slowly give me like passive bites while I'm on Silva. But first, let me do this, because I want a beautiful, beautiful landing pad right now. Because landing pads are cool, and you can't change my mind about it. And I want it to face... rotate? How do I rotate? This. This is how you rotate. I want it to be like this, because I want to be able to access the panel from right here. Perfect. Now I move the rocket ship. Ooh, wait a minute. Hold on. That's dangerous. I destroy it. I see a danger plant. What is that? Why is it red? Is that another research item? Hold on. We might be staying on this planet a little bit longer than I intended. Because there are so many research items here. Like, actually. I could become, like... Okay. Thank you. I could become so many bites. That was English, I swear. I could get so many bites from this. Hold on. I'm going to explore just a little bit more. Because I see... Some more little things that I can grab, like this. Oh my god, seven, like 60, 70 a pop is crazy. That's actually bonkers. What's this? What is this? What am I looking at? What is this? A titan! They're... Okay. You know what? Uh, I'll take it. A titanium alloy is absolutely fucking bonkers. Oh my god. Okay, well maybe it's not as bonkers as I think it is, but it's still cool. It's still really freaking cool. Any danger plants down there? Doesn't seem like it. Let me... Not drop down, because I will die if I do that. Let me try to go around the other side of this. Whoa, this thing's really far into the wall. Whoa. Whoa! How deep does this shit go? Oh my god! What is this? I thought it was just like one of those like small ones. This is a big one. What the hell? How do I get in this? Wait, I think I've reached the end? Maybe? I think I've reached the end. Can I enter now? Oh, I think I see an entrance. Hold on. No, no, no. Tether, 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 tether. You can't do this to me. Okay, I can enter now. Now let's explore this giant ass fucking... Oh, this thing is massive. Jump up. Can I... I can jump over this gap, right? Yeah, I can. Let me jump into here. Come on. You can come on. You can do this. I lied. I'm just gonna make a little pathway. There we go. Okay. What's on the walls? Titanium, I'll take it. Less titanite for me to go try to find. That's scrap. I'm gonna leave the scrap here, honestly, because I don't think scrap is that incredibly useful. Okay, what's in this little subsection? That's a big research item. That's really nice. I do appreciate that. And that's another titanium alloy. I will take it. This was a pretty cool little adventure, I'd say. Got a research item. Got me another titanium alloy. And I got to go really deep into a wall. This thing's really long. I was not expecting it to be that long, like, actually. Good thing, from my times of playing Astroneer, I have become an incredibly good juggler in this game. At one time, I was able to juggle five items at once. I was so incredibly good at juggling. 
I'm not as good now, but I'm still relatively good at juggling. Mostly just like mouse speed thing. If I really wanted to get faster, I'd have to crank up my sensitivity. And I really would prefer not to sweat a game where you just move around items. <laughs> I really don't want to sweat on a game like this, if I'm going to be honest. Because this, this game is not meant to be sweat. This, this is one of those games that's meant to be played casually. And I really like games like that. I think the most fun part about this game is just going to new planets and just finding things. It's so fun just looking at you and being like, oh, what's that? Oh, that's cool. Let me go grab that. It's just, it's so fun. I love how the intended purpose for this freaking uh, exploration to this planet was to get, like, resources. Like, Titanite and Hematite. And I just haven't done any of that. I've kind of just been wandering around, making a base. <laughs> it's fine, though. It's fine. I don't, I don't need to be on, uh, what's the word? Topic? Not topic. It's not topic. What is, it's something similar to to task. I don't need to be on task all the time. Also, I need to get a better drill, because, oh my goodness, this is taking forever to mine. I'm going to wait to start mining hematite, because... Okay, I don't have a reason that I'm waiting. It's mostly just because I kind of feel like it. Oh, I see another one of those things. I love going to those things. More expla exploration. Exploration, yes, yes, yes. If it wasn't obvious, I am cracked out on coffee right now. Ooh, oh my goodness, warm coffee hits. Especially since, like, the past, like, three to four cups of coffee that I've drank. Okay, I haven't drank three to four cups of coffee right now. But, like, the past three to four cu cups of coffee that I've drank in the past few days were cold because I made the coffee. And I was like, okay, I'll go back and get that in five minutes. And then I would come back an hour later and get the coffee. So the coffee is, like, fucking ice cold by the time I get it. So I've drank, like, ice-cold coffee for the past four times that I've been getting coffee. And it's really painful, I'm not going to lie. Cold coffee is almost as bad as torture. It's, it's terrible. I hate it. But I will still drink it because I refuse to waste coffee. I am the one who made the mistake of letting it get cold. I will suffer the consequences of cold coffee. <laughs> Ooh, steel! What's steel? Ooh, that's a... Ooh, dynamite! I can blow that exocache up now. Nice. I've been here for, like, less than 20, 30 minutes, and I've already collected so... Just a stupid amount of items. Ooh. We have TNT now. Let's bring this over here. We can do... We can take care of two birds with one stone by putting this exocache right here next to him. And then just placing some dynamite. Goodbye. Have a good nap. <laughs> I love TNT. Wait, let me give myself some... Do I have tethers? Okie dokie. What kind of loot do you give me? Just exochips. Cool. I kind of thought they could give you diamonds. That might be an old thing. I could have sworn that exocaches could give you diamonds. It might be really rare, though. That's another possibility. Just really rare chance for it to drop. I'm going to put this... On the top of me, right here. That sounded wild, but um, I'm gonna put that there so I can just. Whee! You know what I might do actually? Hold on. Uh, how much does it cost to make that? Hold on. I know it costs iron. Three thousand bytes. I could do this right now. We're gonna do that right now because that's really easy to do, and that'll be really good for research items. Wait, no, it won't. I'm special. That won't be good for research items. What am I talking about? Hold on. This would be good for research items. Yeah, this one is good for research items. What the hell am I talking about? Wait, I'm stupid. Well, now I need clay. Can I get clay on this planet? I don't even know if I can get clay on this planet. Okay. This here. I... No, no, yes. Here. Wire, click, wire, click, no, wire, wire, thank you, no, no. thank you, <laughs> why was that so difficult? I'm actually just gonna get some iron real quick, or some hematite specifically, there we go, this is what I want, this right here, I'm gonna put it on my back for now, 
Okay, so this sound that you're about to hear right now, whenever I grab this hematite, is my favorite sound in this entire game. I love this sound. Hold on. Love that sound. Oh, I love that sound. That sound is fucking awesome. Makes my soul happy. You know, maybe this this one's a sleeper build, I bet you. I bet you there's gonna be so much hematite at the bottom of this. Never mind. Wow, that was actually pathetic. Pfft. I see the danger plants. Hold on. We're about to go on an op mission. Because those guys right there, yeah, them, they're my ops. I gotta kill them. I can't allow them to live. They are one of the only things that can, like, fully kill me on this planet. And I cannot allow that, like, at all. I cannot even think about having them existing while I'm on this planet. Because they will kill me while I'm not paying attention. Ooh. Yum. You know what? I'm not going to fill up my giant thing of hematite. I have to start juggling. There is so many research items on this planet. Oh my god. Well, at least I'm going to have a lot of bites when I leave this planet. Dear god. Just juggle time, I guess. Oh my god. Juggling this this shit is going to give me an aneurysm. <laughs> okay, we have so many research items. Oh my god. <laughs> well, um, lots of bites. That's good, I guess. I'm beginning to think I have a problem with grabbing things. Like, I just, when I see a research item, I just, I can't help myself. I have to grab it. It's just, it's right there. It's, I have to take it. Well, that's a danger plant. Goodbye. You know, at some point, I am actually going to have to get Titanite and Hematite. At some point, I'm going to have to get them. But for right now, I just want to collect things. <laughs> I am just collecting things my brain won't allow me to go like get titanite and shit i see so many research items i need to start researching them <laughs> i need the bites in my blood i need it i can't stop myself <laughs> oh it's done oh it's done wait wait a minute i don't think i'm gonna be able to fit all the research items on this i think i have more than 10 research items oh that's not good well at least I can put some of them on there. Yeah, I'm not going to be able to fit all of them on this. Yeah, I'm... <laughs> That's a little bit of a yikes. But at least I have some storage for them. That's really satisfying looking, I'm not going to lie. <sighs> Fine, I'll grab your research item. No, not more research items. Please, God, no. No. The hell is that? I'll take it. I'll I'll juggle it back with the other items, I guess. Is that a freaking spaceship to explore? I am getting so goddamn sidetracked. I can't even get resin in peace. What's in this thing? I need to know. What's in it? What is in it? I need it. Whatever is in it, I need it. Well, at least I get to show off my juggling skills in this game. <laughs> oh my god. So much juggling. <laughs> I'm starting to think there actually is such a thing as too many items. Nah, I'm fine. I got strong pointer finger. It's fine. I can just keep clicking. It'll be fine. I'm, my hand's totally not cramping up while doing this. Okay, so I want to make curved. Can I get ceramic on this planet? That is the real question. So if I can get ceramic on this planet, I can put all of the store, all of these onto like some kind of a storage thing so I don't have to worry about it anymore. But I need ceramic. That is the only thing I really need. What do I do with this? Oh, it can be cracked with explosives. I happen to have some explosives. Hold on. I want to crack this bitch open. What is inside of you? Let's find out. Detonate. Will I die if I'm here? That was way too close for comfort. But... 
Did I really just use an explosive just to get a shell? It's cool. It's cool, I guess. Should I scan it? I, I kind of don't want to scan it, seeing as if I just wasted an explosive on that. I'm not going to scan it just yet, because I, I feel like that's a waste. I, I just wasted an explosive on that. Really? That's it? Really? All right, then. Okay, let's start by just going back to Silva. I need to go back to Silva. This needs to happen. So, I love all of you little research items, but I have to go back to Silva real quick. Dear God. To Silva! Oh, Silva, how I have missed you. Wait. Are you fucking with me? No, I'm getting fucked with. I'm glad there's a gravity globe right here, but... This is fucked up. This is actually just fucked up. <laughs> well, I guess what I'm gonna do, um... That's actually so messed up. First up, we're actually gonna head back to our real base, because I just got scammed. Alright. Okay, I am back to my regular base, but goddamn, I actually just got scammed by that freaking landing pad, making me think it was my base. Now, we go on an adventure to find my rocket ship. Wait a minute. Oh no, it's not exactly showing me where my other rocket ship is. That's not good. Hopefully when I get in the vicinity of it, it'll tell me that it's around. There you are, my beautiful rocket. I'm actually going to leave this ball here, because just in case I land on this again, I want to have the ball so I can head back to my base really easily. Because, oh my god, this would have actually been so annoying if I didn't have this ball. Now we can actually do what I intended to do by coming back here. I need to get... Cl okay, first up, I need to empty all of this out. Let's start by doing that. I swear, it is so easy to get sidetracked in this game. It's actually ridiculous. Let me make this tractor, and then we are going to head to Glacio. Okay, let's go. <laughs> okay, hello. What was this planet called again? Glacio. Hello, Glacio. I am back. Let me grab both of those real quick. Hold on. Actually, you know, I'm just going to rotate this. There we go. That's much better. Why walk all the way around when I can just do that? And now, actually, I have a tractor on this planet now. So I can really explore if I want to now. Let me give it some power sources, though, so it can actually move around. There we go. Now I have a full-on tractor here. That is what I'm talking about. I don't think I'm going to be playing too much longer, but I really want to get this platform and the large storage built. That is what I want to do before I get off. I want to do both of those things, and then I want to get off. But I want to do those things, so this is going to be a really long waiting game. <laughs> These caves are, like, really, like, wide here. These are really big caves. That's cool. I dig when the caves are big. Let me scan these, see what they do. That's a lot of bites. That, oh my, that is a ton of bites. Also, that is a lot of frozen argon I'm looking at. There we go. That's better. Did, did I just clip that to the... Did I just clip those to the surface? Wait, where did they... Go. I am so confused. Where the hell did they go? I okay, I guess they're just gone. Um That Maybe they're like on the other side of this hill? Okay, they are. Okay, there they are. Okay, big storage. Big storage has been acquired. This is really big storage. This is the storage I needed. Here we go. You are moving to right here. This is going to get moved out the way. This is going to go right here. And then I plug this into here. And then I plug this into here for power. 
Perfect. Wait, no! This is a problem. Hold on. I- this is- I hate G-Force. I hate G-Force so much I can't- Oh my god, hold on. I need to turn full screen off. Where's full screen? Windowed. There we go. There we go. We're gonna have to just look at this red bar for a minute. I hate G-Force. I hate G-Force so much. I hate it. I hate it. Why? Why? Why can't I- Why can't I click on things? I want to close it, but I can't. But it's because it's stuck with Astroneer. Hold on. Freaking get this. Let's get the large sword silo. I have that now. Let me make it, because that's one of the last things I want to do before I get off. God damn, this thing is tall as hell. This is going to be so much storage. This is awesome. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine rows. Nine. Nine two by, two by ones is crazy. That's actually so much storage. Okay, let's put this here and unpack it. And I'm going to put the rest of the freaking research item. I'm going to put this one on there, though, because it's a big item. And I want to make sure I get that. Wait, is this more than nine? Wait, this is, this is 12. Nice. 12 is awesome. Okay, now all of the research items are on storage, which is really good. And... I think this is actually where I'm going to leave off the video. Because there is a lot of things I could do, but they are going to take literally forever. <laughs> so yeah, um, I hope you guys have enjoyed and like, sub, yes, cool, maybe. It'd be cool if you did. But yeah, this is going to be about it. I hope you guys have enjoyed and I'll see you next Monday. <laughs>